Mina, we're going to get through this. Mike. I mean it. Love is not supposed to be about smooth-talking a character to unlock the option to romance him or her. It should be something deeper. And it should not only affect the game, but the gamer as well. With Valentine's Day just around the corner, we give you five reasons why we need better love in gaming. Hey, Kinsey, you wanna fuck? Let's go. Ever since the creation of video games, our beloved medium has been about killing things. Super Mario jumps on turtles, you shoot people in Call of Duty and in basically every other game ever made. Games about companionship and love are rare. Maybe that's because it's hard to make a game about love, but perhaps developers just haven't tried hard enough. Mm. Uh. Here, two sugars. the shotgun looking to the right side and throw he's in the end zone we really need to start buying different games look at the top 10 best-selling games of 2014 and you will see lots of sports games shooters and action games the only game that does not seem to influence our testosterone levels is minecraft even though you can play the hunger games mod of course where is the love guys In most games, the love interest serves as a motivator for the main character to do something. Mario needs to rescue Peach. In the darkness, Jackie goes on a killing spree for his girl, and even in Shadow of Colossus, our hero kills giants to save his princess. Relationships in gaming need to go beyond just saving someone. BioWare does it better by making romance part of the game. Now, if only those relationships would go deeper than doing personal missions until you can bang someone. I hope you don't have too many new bruises. <laughs> Just enough to get my attention. Yuna, I have to go. <laughs> Besides Bioware, Square Enix also has a good reputation when it comes to building relationships in games. But they too need to take that extra step. In the Final Fantasy series, the characters are hardly ever outspoken about their love for each other, which is a pity. We need more stuff like this couch scene in the darkness. Sitting next to your girlfriend and watching TV together made this relationship feel very real. It's good having you here. It's kind of calming. For years, developers have been aiming to generate lifelike characters, ranging from the way they look to the way they move. Realistic emotions and relationships should be the next big evolution of gaming. And the better developers portray love, the more engaged you will be. The moment we feel love between game characters is the moment we can truly speak of the next generation in gaming.